Hey there everyone, welcome back to the channel and in today's video we're going to talk about that Create Link is not working on your iPhone using iOS 15. Now after the recent update that Apple introduced a new feature with your FaceTime which allows you to just send a link to your friend who has Android device but for some reason if you cannot share your link then this is the video that you want to watch. Now the very first recommendation that we want you guys to check is your internet stability, okay? Now if your internet is not working well, then the problem can happen, okay? Now all you can do, just go ahead and open up your browser and try loading any website to check whether it is working or not. So if you see that your internet is slow, it's not working properly, then go ahead and swipe it down from the top and then check whether your cellular and Wi-Fi is both turned on or not. So if you see that both are turned on, now go ahead and turn off your cellular data and now you can simply turn on your airplane mode and then wait around 5 seconds and you simply can turn it back off to give you a little bit of troubleshooting on your network, okay? Afterward, your network related problem will be solved. Now the next things you gotta check is the system status for your FaceTime, okay? Now you can simply open up your browser and you can just type Apple system status and then you will be able to come to this page okay now go ahead and tap on there now afterward go ahead and tap plus and then if you're just gonna go ahead and scroll down here then if you just zoom in a little bit then you'll be able to see your FaceTime okay now if you see your FaceTime is not available here then this problem can happen on your iPhone so in that case you have to wait unless Apple fix it itself for you okay afterward your problem will be solved now let's go ahead and talk about the next troubleshooting process which is you have to do a little work with that FaceTime itself okay now go ahead and tap your settings now scroll down a little bit and just tap your FaceTime and then go ahead and turn it off and now go ahead and press the volume up button and down button and quickly press and hold your power button and keep it holding unless you see that Apple logo appears on your iPhone Now, after you've given a forced restart on your iPhone, the next things you gotta do, just go ahead and open up your setting one more time and scroll down to your FaceTime, okay? Go ahead and tap on there and go ahead and toggle on your FaceTime and then your problem will be solved. Now, go ahead and tap OK. Alright guys, so even after doing that process, if you're still having the same problem, the next things you gotta do, just go ahead and open up your settings and then scroll down to your screen time, then scroll down to your content and privacy restrictions, and then all you have to do is just tap allow apps and enter your screen time passcode and then check whether your FaceTime and your camera is turned on or off, okay? So if you see they are turned off, go ahead and turn it back on and then tap back. Now for safety purpose, you simply can turn off the content and privacy restriction to fix your FaceTime is not working on your iPhone, okay? Now after doing this process, now let's go ahead and try it again whether it is working. I mean, your FaceTime is working back to normal again or not. If you're still having the same problem, the next things you gotta check is your date and time, okay? Now if you just go ahead and tap your settings, now scroll down to your general, and then scroll down to your date and time and if you see it is not set on automatically make sure to hit it up to set automatically to fix your date and time hopefully afterward your problem will be solved on your FaceTime alright guys now after doing all of the process at once now still if you're having the problem with your FaceTime now the last but not least things that you guys can check is very easy just go ahead and head over to your settings and then scroll down to your general and go ahead and type your software update okay now if you found the new software available for your iPhone go ahead and update it hopefully that will fix your problem now even after that if you're still having the same problem go ahead and tap back and scroll down to your reset option Go ahead and tap on there and then go ahead and tap reset all settings and then enter your passcode and then enter your screen time passcode if it's enabled. And now before you go ahead and tap restore settings, here is what you need to know, okay? That will not delete your data and content from your iPhone, but all the settings will get back to it in its default, okay? Now go ahead and tap restore all settings. Now you do it again and your problem will be solved after that, all right? Now after you have resetted your device, all you gotta do is just go ahead and connect your iPhone to the network and also make sure to active your FaceTime and then check whether it is working or not. 
All right, guys, as you guys can see right now, it is working completely fine. It doesn't have no problem whatsoever. And this is how you can fix it. Your FaceTime is not working or just not creating the link. And this is how you can solve it. Hope this video is pretty useful, guys. If you leave a like and subscribe to this channel to get more useful video content for yourself. Thanks for watching, and we will talk to you all soon.